why give them anything, like, to work with? Bulletin board material, why? <laughs> I just made a video today talking about how I love Cam Taylor, which I do. And I love how he trash talks, but he said he's going to trash talk during the game. He said, hey, I'm going to trash talk during the game. I don't like him, blah, blah, blah. And I said, that's fine. That's perfect. Don't trash him before the game. During the game, trash them, get in their head, play the mental head games, right? That's part of football. But don't give them anything to work with going into the game. And for some reason, Cam Taylor Britt decides to target the fastest receiver in football and make that the definition here. So, Xavier Worthy last week had two touchdowns, and he actually looked really good. Now, one of his touchdowns was he outran the whole Ratbirds defense. The other touchdown being that he uh, there was a blown coverage where Kyle Hamilton was supposed to cover the right-hand side. Doesn't. Xavier Worthy gets wide open. Not really a situation that I would say was 100% Xavier Worthy being amazing. It was kind of just like, again, blown coverage. I say that because Kyle Hamilton himself has came out and said 100% that was on him. And it wasn't on Zach or it wasn't on... You know, Xavier Worthy being amazing. It was just simply he did not do his responsibility. So, obviously, they're going to ask about Xavier Worthy to Cam Taylor Bright. He responds, speed. He can run straight. Can't really do much outside of that. And even if you feel that way, why say it? Why say it? Because now the Chiefs are going to go into this game. And try to catch touchdown passes on Cam Taylor Britt with Xavier Worthy. The game plan is now going to be get the ball to Xavier Worthy to embarrass Cam Taylor Britt. And I'll be straight up honest. I think the Bills should be fined, kicked out of the league, and gotten rid of. Because they gave the Chiefs Xavier Worthy. I don't know if Xavier Worthy's ever going to pan out to become the best receiver. But he's still a good receiver. And he can still do more than just run the ball. I disagree here with Cam Taylor Bright. I think Xavier Worthy is more than just a speed demon. I think he can catch it. I think he can run routes. I think he can do a lot of things, okay? Yes, was he a first-round pick a lot because of his speed? Absolutely. But that's not the only thing the guy can do, okay? He also has the best, one of the best quarterbacks back there in number 15. So when you add in really great speed, an amazing head coach in Andy Reid, plus Patrick Mahomes, okay, as you automatically get a plus one. You automatically get boosted up. So if this was like, I don't know, like Deshaun Watson back there throwing in the ball, I could understand the trash talk. But not when, if Patrick Mahomes back there, dude, Andy Reid, is like a mad scientist. Like I call, you know, Lou Anarumo the mad scientist on defense. Andy Reid is the mad scientist on offense. His play calls, his crazy things that he calls, that, that needs to be studied. Like, really. They need to teach coaches based on how Andy Reid calls his plays. And now you just poke the bear. And the worst thing is the bear can run 4.22. I don't know. I love Cam Taylor Britt, but like I said in my video earlier today, trash talk during the game. Maybe after the game. Don't do it before. You can say I don't like him. Who cares? You know, that's, that's an opinion. But to completely bash a guy and say that he's nothing but speed? Bro, why? Why do that? Like, we're going into this game. This is a trap game for us. Like, for the Chiefs, it's a trap game. They think they're going to demolish us. They think they're going to destroy us. Cool, right? Good. Think that way. We go into this game. We trap game them. We win. Period. End of story. Everything's good. Don't give them firepower. Don't give them ammunition. <sighs> I don't know. I, 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 uh... Again, like I said, I love Cam Taylor. I really do. It's just, bro, we don't need the Cincinnati Bengals mayor again, bro. I'm sorry, we don't. 
We don't need these comments. You know, we trash talk after the game. Or during the game. Get in our head, but I don't know. Guys, tell me down below your thoughts and opinions. It was this was this a little bit too extreme on my side or on his side? What are you guys thinking? I mean, again, like I said, maybe Xavier Worthy ends up doing nothing this game. But he honestly, out of all the receivers on their team, he's the most I'm scared of. Like, because he could take one play to the house within seconds. And with good play calling like Reed does, it is very dangerous to have any type of anger toward... Well, Xavier Wood, they have to, any type of anger toward you guys. I say toward you guys. Toward you as like a cornerback. I don't know why I said toward you guys. Toward you as a cornerback, but peace out, guys.